Hi, Katie here, and this is your Galco TV industry news update. This week, we're talking about how Amazon unwittingly triggered a robot arms race and the generation of digital solar power production. Amazon has triggered a race and now everyone is trying to catch up. Back in 2012, Amazon purchased Kaiva Systems, a warehouse automation firm for a whopping $775 million. Prior to the purchase, Kaiva robots were used by several retailers worldwide, proving that warehouse automation was more efficient than an all-human workforce. But when Amazon bought the company, they left retailers in the dust, deciding to keep the robots for themselves. For Amazon, the benefits have been great, with 30,000 robots in its warehouses worldwide. It has reduced operating expenses by as much as 20%. Other retailers haven't been so lucky. Walmart, Macy's, and even Target still use people to pick their items, pack them, and send them down the conveyor belt. Locust Robotics, a spin-off of Quiet Logistics, which actually built the software systems around Kaiva's robots, has developed its own working prototype. In just two years, Locust Robotics was up and running, eventually spinning off into its own company. Just in May, Locus raised $8 million in venture capital funding to develop their technology. Other companies have begun developing their own versions as well. As for Kaiva Systems, several former employees left the company after Amazon's purchase and founded their own startup to develop pilot programs for warehouse automation technology. Their solutions have not yet been disclosed. And the digitization of the solar industry is becoming a reality, starting with string inverters. This is an important step for solar developers interested in reliability and increased control over the performance of their investments. String inverters are converting the DC electricity produced by solar panels in the AC electricity that is typically used in the home. Huawei, a Chinese multinational telecommunications equipment and services company, is leading the charge towards a digital solar industry. In 2014, Huawei discontinued their central inverter business to focus on string inverters. In the last 10 years, they have invested 30 Seven billion dollars into six R&D centers around the world. Over 800 engineers are working to improve inverter design and functionality and reduce costs. Their goal? To use string inverters to monitor what's happening in the field, understanding problems with panels, trackers, energy generation, and environmental changes, all while managing them remotely. Just last year, Huawei introduced the Fusion Solar Smart PV Management System, which leverages data analytics to remotely monitor a solar plant's performance at the individual string level. To boost efficiency offered by Smart PV string inverters, Huawei eliminated parts that are susceptible to failure and replacement, like fuses, fans, and LCD screens, to reduce wasted energy and improve heat management. The benefits are great with low initial cost relative to price per watt, easy to install, accept inputs from multiple solar panels, and they're easy to maintain. These benefits will only accelerate as costs continue to lower and innovation increases. That's it for this week's industry update. Make sure you tune in next week for more of the latest news in electronics, automation, and robotics.